Out in my backyard, that's what some folks are saying in one Delaware County community. Kelly Rule live in Marple Township, where some very vocal residents don't want Pico to put a new station site there. Kelly. Well, Jason, approximately 200 residents are expected to testify between today and tomorrow in hearings with the Pennsylvania Public Utility Commission. These are telephone hearings about the proposed site. People I spoke with today tell me they're not against the project. They're against this specific location for the project. So it's been a fight. A fight outlined on the side of Bob Durazio's van and on signs surrounding the corner of Sproul and Cedar Grove Roads in Broomall, Marple Township for months now. It's going to force me to move. We're already looking. We're not opposing this existing. We're opposing that this is going to exist in our neighborhood. It just shows that Pico has no regard to the public's uh, say. These voices, part of the Marple Safety Coalition. They help gather nearly 200 people to testify Tuesday and Wednesday in telephone hearings with the Pennsylvania Public Utility Commission, alongside attorneys representing Marple Township and Delaware County. It's over the location of Pico's proposed natural gas reliability station in the township's empty lot next to Freddy's Frozen Custard and Steak Burgers, a short walk from an elementary school, and feet from people's homes. They're concerned about health and safety to traffic and property values. Marple Township's zoning hearing board denied Pico's special zoning exception request last year, and Pico is appealing, saying they need the project in order to keep up with demand. If they do this to our township, they're setting a precedent where they can do it to anybody. And in some very short period of time, we will have a constraint on our system uh, where our existing customers won't have sufficient gas. Vice President of Governmental and External Affairs for PICO, Doug Oliver, says that concern is based on growth in Marple Township over the past 10 years and the growth they expect over the next 10. He says the project needs to be near existing underground infrastructure. They looked into 10 possible locations, but size, zoning, and availability ruled them all out. At this point, uh, we're going to push forward with the site that we have and, again, continue to work with the community to help them understand the why. Many are speaking up to say they don't see one. Many of the neighbors in this area do not have natural gas service, nor have we ever been offered natural gas service. Now, there is a judge presiding over the hearings today and tomorrow, which are strictly for testimony. There will not be any decisions made this week. In fact, Jason, there's no timetable on when a decision will be made, but we can tell you people in this area will be closely watching. All right, Kelly Rule live in Marple Township, Delco. Thank you, Kelly.